All right, everyone, we're back again, another day. I don't think that's metal. This will be a fun little project piece. I just don't like working on these things. I don't think I'll probably keep them because they aren't your higher tier brands. I'm not saying that they're not good quality when they ran. I just don't even know what, what that is. It might be one of those, I don't know, it's called like beaver or something. And a wood chipper. So good morning, everyone back again. All clean up, garbage picking, you name it, we're out here trash picking. Try to find some cool things people have thrown away out in the garbage. Do a little curbside scavenging. Let's find some cool things and make it an awesome day of trash picking. What do you say? Let's do it. We made the town. Kids from last week are chasing down just started yelling at me again this week. Big fans of the channel, apparently. Uh, we're in town. Yeah. Ooh. I wonder if it works. Talking about the television. This is the only one that I can scrap out of all of them if they don't work uh, in terms of vacuum cleaners. Televisions, television. Man, they're starting to pop up everywhere now. I've got a couple in those storage units. The last one I got, uh, it did not work. It was actually broken on the screen. It was the one that was in between the two mattresses or the mattress and the box spring. Um, yeah, it didn't work, and it was extremely heavy. I don't know if I captured how heavy it was on camera, but the thing probably weighed close to 80 pounds. Fortunately, my scrapyard takes them for free if they are broken. Uh, they don't pay you, uh, but it goes as e-waste and gets recycled accordingly. Uh, but probably weighed like 80 to 100 pounds, which most flat screen TVs don't weigh that much. They probably weigh 30 or 40. It was quite heavy. I don't know what that is. Got some wire. I thought it was a VHS player or something on top, and it wasn't. I don't know what they did there. We have a lot of colors going on. We have the pinks, the reds going down here. We have some yellows, some oranges. This car is getting absolutely obliterated with leaves. Those are some nice trees. But man, there are a ton of piles of sticks and piles of garbage bags of leaves. Only you can be uh, rich on those two. what that thing is worth. I'm not trying to destroy their garbage bags and stuff they have in there. There's a lot of just junk and assorted stuff. This is interesting. This is vintage. Looks like a side table. The bomb side doesn't look too great. That's pretty cool. It's almost like those Formica tables. Hey look, we have a glider as well. I did not make the last clip. I just looked at my camera. And it wasn't on. We have a glider. Looks like it's all there. You need the uh, the seats or the cushions for it. I thought the van just shut off on me. I said, don't, don't start. The last thing I need right now is vehicle problems with my van. 
Now, if people start pressing random buttons on the screen, might be able to afford a new van. What those buttons are, I don't know, but apparently a lot of YouTubers say that. Just start smashing random buttons, and good things happen. And oh, that glass looks bad shape. Don't think it's. There we go. Good. Good. Oh man, this thing is heavy. Wonder if this did it. But yeah, start pressing random buttons on the screen. I don't know. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Let's get this video to a million views. Been a long time since we had a viral video on the channel. Don't think this is gonna go viral, but it might. Taking stuff in the trash, giving it a new home. That glider looks pretty nice. It looks like it, uh, it was in someone's home for a very long time. Oh, what the world? I guess we beat all of our competition today. I don't. I don't know, sometimes when I say it, that I speak too soon and it's like the last clip of the video. But I'm surprised we're finding as much metal as we are. It is kind of a warmer day. Well, it feels like a perfect fall day, but we're kind of towards the end of fall here. Not really, but we've been in fall for a little bit. At least it feels like it. Um, so I guess people are kind of doing a little bit of work. Getting rid of the stuff. Things they don't want to hold till next winter. They had to do something about the wind noise. Wish GoPro offered better audio. <laughs> I would say audio and film um, settings, but they don't. It's kind of standard. Still need another action shot camera. One that can zoom would be nice. And uh, no, I'm not buying a new GoPro. I buy one, one every two years anyway. One every year, the way we're going. But, uh, yeah, maybe people are getting some stuff out. Might be some stuff up here on the right after these sticks and branches. Sticks and branches and bags of leaves. What is this? And that's just cardboard and a mop. Something we don't see every day. Okay, harder and harder to see it also. Not, not like, literally, but you don't see a lot of it anymore. And that is this. It's a uh, downspout elbow, but it's out of copper. You don't see a lot of uh, gutters and downspouts anymore made in copper. It's, uh, it's way too costly. It does look nice, but you're not going to see a lot of it. This is probably like $2 in scrap. It's not a lot, but um, something you don't see every day. What random item do we have out there this week? We have a baby crib. Missing the bottom and a chair. I'm pretty sure a chair was there last week. Those are the mysterious pieces for this week. And some sort of cabinet on the right, which we don't. I thought I'd get shut out here in the last town, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen. About two years ago up there, well, one of those houses up there, had some really awesome furniture. It was like a very sad story with the guy. Yeah, he was a furniture dealer and something with his house. And long story short, he had to sell the property. And he got rid of all of his project pieces. And I picked up some really, really nice stuff. Um, I mean, his whole line, his whole driveway was just lined with nice nice furniture. I'm talking like tiger oak um, and mission oak and walnut. Some nice pieces. I was able to rescue. It was all out for trash. Uh, kind of felt bad, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Alright, I guess we're kind of getting into the boomer, boomer bust uh, ter 
territory of trash picking here in the winter months. It looks like we have a bunch here, but we really uh, got a lot of empty space up front. Um, do have some metal. Um, I don't know about this vintage table. It's looking a little pitted. It's amazing. I'm looking at the back of the camera where I can see what you guys are seeing. And this stuff looks way worse in person. That shadow right down the middle looks like it's a clean spot. It's not. It's just the shadow the light it is very very pitted uh so we have a lot of that this i believe is either a wood chipper it's more like a twig chipper i uh, can't show the other side well if i walked around i could probably show you it but the spacing of it is like that wide like you're not fitting larger than like a one inch branch in there i've never actually used one and uh it's kind of sketchy that it's electrical because then you have to run like an extension cord out into like the middle of your yard I feel like that'd be a lot of work. Um, I also don't know where this blue paint came from. I just noticed that halfway through this episode. So that is also something I gotta think about. I don't know how I'm gonna get that off. I don't know how uh, strong it is. I also don't know what brand that yellow one is, but we got a couple parts chainsaws. Maybe I'll see if any of that stuff is worth anything. I know if it was a better brand, looks like it's missing the spark plug as well. Even though I think it needs a lot more than just a spark plug. But uh, today was another awesome day. Another beautiful day to do some trash picking. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this wonderful adventure with me. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it, definitely smack the like button. Subscribe down below. Check out my trash picking playlist. I do have a ton of really, really cool finds that we found in the past. Of uh, cool things that we found in the trash. So check that out if you haven't already. And I'll catch up with you guys next time for our next adventure. Who knows what we'll get into. Certainly be something fun. Thanks for coming along. Until next time, have a great day. Keep living the dream. Peace. <laughs>